Hey there, dear from the Bomb Life, where I talk about anything and everything motherhood. Today we will be unboxing and trying out sneak peek early gender DNA test. So this is a DNA test to find out whether you're having a boy or a girl as early as eight weeks. And it claims to be 99.1% accurate. So let's try it out right now. So I am currently 16 weeks pregnant with baby number two, and I will find out the gender in three weeks in my anatomy ultrasound. So we can compare in three weeks whether or not this thing is accurate. So um, this is what the box looks like. Okay, can you see it? Yeah, so this is what the box looks like. And it says here, females only. Sample collection components have been sterilized. Avoid male contact with contents within this kit. Okay, so let's open the box and see what's inside. Okay, so first things first, you need to drink eight ounces of water before doing the test. So, you know, it will help with the blood flow. So let's drink first and then we'll proceed. Next, you need to sanitize the area or table where you will be doing the test. So let's sanitize my table. Okay, so let's see what's inside this box. Okay. Prior to taking your sample, activate your kit using the unique barcode below. Okay. So we have the barcode right there and then we have stickers that's so cute mom life oh that's my channel um step-by-step -step instruction it's right here and then um a discount code 10 percent off and then, we, then what's this this one is a collection tube that's a collection tube and this is a gauze then fingernail brush, tourniquet, three lancets, and what's that? Alcohol swab. So yeah, so that's everything. Okay, so let me just go ahead and wash my hand with the fingernail brush they provided. And um, I'll air dry my hands as per the instruction. So I'll be right back. Let's do this. It says that I need to be standing up while doing the test, then rotate the arm that you will be using multiple times. So I'll be using my left arm and make a fist 10 times. So we'll do that right now. Once done, put the tourniquet on your wrist and collect the sample. Perfect. Okay, so first things first, you need to set up collection tube and lancet. Insert collection tube into the hole it's in the box securely to prevent tipping. And then you remove and place the lancets, the alcohol swabs, the resealable bag with gauze on a clean surface. And then you open the lid of collection tube. Next is you clean your fingertip with the alcohol wipes and let it dry. You put your tourniquet on your wrist and hold lancet with your fingers on the grooves and place it on the side of your finger with a narrow side facing you. Press firmly against your finger and apply a large amount of pressure until you hear the lancet click. So that's where you collect the blood. The blood will begin to flow immediately and you start applying pressure from the top of your finger below the knuckle and massage it downwards. You need to press it firmly at your fingertip until a full blood drop form. After collecting the blood, you put a bandage on your finger. You make sample preservatives to break any blood clots. And finally, you put it in the resealable bag with gauze and seal it. Okay, so we're done collecting the sample. 
I already put it in a resealable bag with the gauze inside and the collection tube is right there. So um, instruction says put it back in the test kit and um, close it using the adhesive strip. It's right there. It's the adhesive strip. So let me close it real quick. Okay, now it's closed. I need to stick the return label that was included in the box. So you need to stick it right here on the back. So let me do that right now. And it's ready to be sent back to the lab that was a little messy okay so i'll be dropping this off at the ups not in the mailbox because the outside temperature might affect the the blood sample so um sneak peek said that once they receive the result you should receive i mean once they receive the blood sample you should receive the result the next day from um, between 10 a.m to 2 p.m pacific time so i'm gonna be dropping this off right now so on September 11th, I registered the unique barcode included in the kit online at sneak peek test slash activate. And after about a minute, I received this email saying I activated my barcode and standard sneak peek is estimated to be received around two to three business days while the fast track is one business day. So I sent my blood sample on the 12th, which is a Friday, and I got an email from them on the 16th, which is a Wednesday. So that's three business days from the day I mailed it. It says in the email that results will arrive tomorrow between 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific time. So the next day I did receive the email with the result, and here it is. So according to Sneak Peek, I am having another boy. So you're probably wondering if this is accurate. So here is a clip of my mini gender reveal for my husband. <laughs> Yeah.